Sweating is kind of a nuisance. It makes us smelly, slimy, and can often be embarrassing. But did you know that sweating has a number of amazing benefits, like reducing pain, clearing up your skin, and more? Today here at Bestie, we're gonna dive into why sweating can be good for your mind and body. Don't sweat it. There's a super easy way to keep up to date on all your favorite videos here at Bestie. Just hit that subscribe button and click the notification bell too. Before we get into the benefits of sweating it out, we thought it might be ideal to go over what sweat actually is. Perspiration is mostly made of water with small amounts of specific chemicals mixed in. These chemicals are sugar, salt, urea, and ammonia. A common misunderstanding when it comes to perspiration is that it smells. Well, fun fact about sweating, it doesn't actually smell. When you sweat, it mixes with bacteria that's already on your skin, which could cause an unpleasant odor, or that sweat will mix with hormones that live in places like your armpits, which again is what causes that less than rosy smell. If you think that sweating is more annoying than beneficial, you should stick around. We might change your mind after you check out these nine great health benefits of sweating. Helps keep us comfy. The first and maybe most obvious function of sweating is that it helps us regulate our internal temperature. When it's the middle of a really hot day and the air conditioning goes down, you better believe your body is gonna start to produce some sweat. That's how your body cools itself. When the sweat glands start releasing sweat onto your skin, it'll evaporate, cooling your skin and the blood underneath. This will help to bring down your body's rising temperature. It's like a natural detox. Can sweating help cure you from a hangover? Kinda. Research shows that sweating is your body's way of releasing natural and unnatural toxins from your system. Toxins like cholesterol, types of salt, and yes, even alcohol. Plus, the more you exercise and work out your sweat glands, the better job they'll do of removing all this bad stuff from your body. Boosts immune system. Boosting your immune system is always a good idea. Who knew that sweating can help you fight off infection as well? According to one study, researchers found that sweat kind of acts like our antibodies in the way they help fight off infection. Scientists have also suggested that harmful viruses and bacteria don't like sweat, and that means sweat could be more effective than some antibiotics in the long run. Perspiring can possibly heal your wounds. More research is being discovered all the time on this topic, but sweat might be more powerful than we think. Humans have millions of tiny sweat glands called eggrine sweat glands, which are the ones that bring water to the surface of the skin to cool us down. Dr. Lori Rite discovered that eggrine glands are extremely understudied because they are unique to humans. Dr. Rite says, the regenerative potential of sweat glands has been one of our body's best kept secrets. Our findings certainly advance our understanding of the normal healing process, and will hopefully pave the way for designing better, targeted therapies. Healthier looking skin. Paired with a good hygiene routine, sweat can help get rid of all that gunk that can build up in our pores from regular everyday life. Having healthy sweat glands can help push out all that grit and bacteria that's trapped underneath, which can cause unwanted skin irritation or acne, which no one likes. So if you want to reap the benefits that come with sweating, hit up the gym and clear up that skin. Just make sure to wash away all that grime and sweat afterwards. Protects your heart. If you've never used a sauna before, maybe it's time to start. Research shows that saunas can improve blood circulation, which is great for the heart. Saunas are a great way to work out those sweat glands and help you to relax, which is great for your body and for your mind. Makes you happier. This one kind of depends on the scenario. If you're wearing your favorite shirt to an intense job interview and you start sweating through the fabric, that might not make you feel amazing. We're talking about those moments post-exercise, when you're really making your body sweat. Working out can help your body release endorphins, which are there to make you feel good. 
So if you've been feeling a little down in the dumps lately, maybe try adding more exercise into your routine. This will help benefit your mood and make you a healthier, happier person. Keeps kidney stones away. If you've ever had a kidney stone, you can attest to how painful they can be. Ouch! Everyone should want to avoid this troublesome, painful condition. Kidney stones can happen to anyone, but usually are the result of a poor diet or not drinking enough water to flush out your kidneys. The University of Washington says that people who sweat more often tend to help their body get rid of excess salt and calcium that can form in the kidneys and cause those painful little stones. People who perspire frequently also tend to drink more fluids, including water, which is another great way to prevent kidney stones from happening. Pheromones, anyone? Who knew women were so attracted to sweat? Pheromones are something our bodies secrete, and while you may not be able to actually smell them, they're there, and they certainly do have an effect. Pheromones are released many ways, but the most obvious is through perspiration. One study showed that when sweat was introduced on a male, it increased the attraction from women. Plus, it can boost a woman's mood and focus as well. Remember, these are pheromones, not body odor, so don't ditch the deodorant just yet. Remember, even though sweating might not be welcome in every scenario, it's a completely natural and healthy function that all humans have. Exercise promotes sweat, and with these benefits we just listed, maybe that will inspire you to incorporate some more exercise into your daily life. Keeping those sweat glands active will give you a number of different health benefits and keep you feeling great. And that's the video. What did you think of all that sweat talk? Do you do everything to try and avoid sweating or are you someone who loves to get their sweat on? Do you have a favorite way to work out and start sweating? Were you surprised by any of the great benefits sweating can have? Let us know in the comment section below how you're going to add more sweating opportunities to your daily routine. Enjoyed this video? Hit the like button and share with your friends. Also, subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.